So even though these injectors are uh, all just a little bit different, the signs of failure on them are, are quite similar. Before we get into today's video, if you're looking to keep your diesel engine running at peak performance on the road, be sure to hit the subscribe button and your search for answers and engine components with our industry leading technical service and parts featured here at HHP. Also, be sure to check out highwayandheavyparts.com for our online resource library offering additional help for all major heavy duty makes and models. Hit subscribe, get informed, get back on the road with America's trusted diesel engine parts supplier. You may find that you have uh, excessive smoke, hard start. Um, if the timing in the injector gets off, you might, you might notice a fuel knock. Um, you may have uh, a tip blown off the injector that is gonna cause uh, real excessive smoke. Uh, you might have something that's just got a million miles on it and from all the fuel going through it has worn over the years and you barely notice that there's something wrong with it until you put a new set of injectors in. Then you can really notice, hey, what was, what was going on there? It's getting great fuel mileage now. It's, getting, it's got a lot of power. Uh, it hasn't felt this good since the engine was new. Those are some of the comments that we get when, uh, when guys are going through putting, putting injectors in their engine. So even though the injectors are a little bit different, actuated different, uh, controlled differently, uh, the signs of failure are very similar between all the injectors here. So just a couple examples here that I've gathered uh, of some failed injectors. Um, this particular one is a Caterpillar injector. Um, it blew the tip off the injector. Oftentimes it's caused by uh, either air in your fuel system or water in the fuel system. Um, and as you can see, compared to one with a tip on it, these two are uh, significantly different. This one in its own right, this one had an internal engine failure that, uh, that caused the injector to fail. Uh, it may have dropped the valve, but you can see on this one, the spray holes where the fuel comes out are completely smashed, which caused that one to not deliver any fuel at all. But uh, this wasn't the biggest problem in this engine. It was just a secondary problem. And then I've got this one here, uh, this uh, Detroit diesel injector. You can see the, uh, the return spring for the plunger has, has broken. Probably just over time, a lot of cycles, a lot of years on the engine, um, something that uh, occasionally happens. So when you put a new set of injectors in your engine, you're gonna expect that you're gonna get a little bit better fuel mileage, you're gonna get more power, um, you're gonna get that smooth running engine back that you had when that engine was new. Our mission is to take the risk out of buying diesel engine parts for our customers. So if you're looking for affordable OEM quality diesel engine parts with expert advice on the other end of the line, we're here to help. If you have any questions, you can call any of our ASC certified technicians at 844-447-1453, or you can chat with us online at highwayandheavyparts.com. Be sure to like this video and hit the subscribe button on YouTube, Facebook, and all our additional social media channels to stay up to date on all news and information from Highway and Heavy Parts. From diagnosis through delivery, we will be there.